Hello folks, welcome back to the IB and Andy Fishing channel and welcome back to DB of DB Fishing. You guys will know the channel. If not, I'll put a link in the description. Dan has one of the, if not the biggest, lure fishing channel Most based in the UK specific one, on yeah. YouTube. Yeah, so that's really cool. Uh, we've already done one challenge. I got my book kicked. We're about to do another one. I would one. say kicked. I'm probably about Just to get my book kicked again, but it's slightly different this one. We've gone totally the opposite end. We've spent two days there throwing 100 gram, 150 gram rods, yeah. big baits, all that stuff. We're going to go right the other way now. Micro lure fishing challenge for perch. We're doing some serious wasping just to try and boost our egos <laughs> a little bit. So <laughs> we've seen a few perch moving around. Uh, this should be really fun. As many fish as possible in 90 minutes, shall we? Is that enough? Yeah, an hour and a half. We should catch at least one perch each in that time. <laughs> <laughs> if we only catch one fish each, there's no way this is going on YouTube, by the way. Not a chance. I can't do it again. I'm never coming back here again. Yeah. <laughs> uh, what do you reckon? Couple of rods each? Uh, yeah, use as many rods as you want. Uh, just, just catch some fish. <laughs> just catch some fish, yeah. yeah, absolutely. Any kicker rules, big fish, species? Uh, so we should keep it nice and simple. Yeah, I'd say any species counts, okay. but we're really going for perch, and whoever catches the most fish. So, yep, if I'd... you catch 50 roach, you can win. <laughs> <laughs> no, Milo, that's probably about, that's yeah. about right. <laughs> guys, we're going to crack straight on. We've got some rigging to do. We've got some rods to set up, and we'll meet you guys at the... Canal? canal, yeah, canal. I don't even know where we are. There we go. <laughs> Middle we'll of meet, nowhere. We'll meet you at the canal. Righty, first cast, and actually in an area that I had some interest in early on in the day, pike fishing. I've gone for that little jerk bait. <laughs> that counts. Does that count? Yeah, it's not, I've got it in my hand. First cast. Yeah, Dan's got one first cast. How big is that? Eight centimeters? At the very most. <laughs> Should barely count. Right, right so I'm, I'm already in trouble. Oh, slightly better stamp of follower. Go on, eat it, eat it, eat it. Got him. Got him. Uh, it's, it's a foully, I'm not sure that counts. I mean, it will have gone for it, won't it? Oh, yeah, it, it went for the bait, yeah. Really Am I counting that? Yeah. That's pretty generous. Oh, yeah, I've noticed you've let me have one fish, but you've also poached my spot. I see how this works. Yeah, he properly swipes at it. Oh, go on, eat it. One of you eat it. That's a slightly better fish, actually, there. So I had to follow them from a slightly better fish. Probably half pound. Sorry? Oh, wow, yeah, they are small. Oh, straight away. Are you going shad? Tiny little 3D fry, yeah. They are whacking this. One of them nearly ripped it off the bloody hook. You got him? got him. This is small. That's two fish, though. Two one. That's even smaller than the last fish. That, sh that should barely count. <laughs> <laughs> says, says, says the guy with the foul hooker. Oh yeah, definitely. Yeah. You it? Oh, oh, better fish? Uh, slightly better. Get a follower as well. Oh yeah. Ten, ten fish following it. There, are there we there. go. That's a better stamp of fish. Nearly, nearly missed the water there. Oh, that's a... oh on the drop. <laughs> you Nah, this, they're, they're eating it. That's a really nice piece of it. On the drop, that was really good. Right. There we go. Oh, you got one? Three, two, three. I'm still winning. I'm gonna, I want to keep this lead going. <laughs> cost myself, I cost myself a minute with the jerk bait. Does that count? Did you touch it? Yep. Definitely touched it. There you go. Too easy. I just, oh, by the way, that that fell off, and as it was falling, I tapped it. <laughs> I don't know if it counts if you're not if it's not hooks when you're touching it. Oh, I lost one at the same time as well. Oh, so got it. <laughs> Why didn't we do this yesterday? Oh, watch that. That was a bigger fish, that one. There we go. I got that fish. I got that one, yeah. The one just caught from mine. Take it, take it, take it. Oh, there's three behind it. Yep. Oh, this is kind of frustrating. It's five, five now. Then. Eleven. Oh, no way. That's six, five. Six, five. Yeah. Crikey. 
I'll tell you what I've got actually in my bag. I've got an Eco Gear Shirasu kit. Oh yeah. That might, oh my God. That, oh. that might be worth burning 60 seconds to put that small allure on. Oh, maybe, yeah, but 60 so, seconds, I might get a five fish. Because I've got a lead, I've got a little bit to play with here. And I reckon the tiny, tiny lure could buy me a fish. Oh, mate, you're in trouble here. You are in Ooh. trouble. 25 mil grass minnow. Oh, no way. That is, yeah, you're going to get fish first after that. There we go. <laughs> <laughs> oh, no. That, that eco kit, eco gear kit was such a like last minute thing at home as well. I was like, oh, I'll take that just in case we do some dibbling. They are so good, those little grass minnows, aren't they? I feel like I found a competition that's slightly more my level. Yeah. Catching tiny little perch that no one else cares about. Got him. No. This is not that <laughs> Eight, six? Eight, six. Okay, nine. It's a nine when you see a shoulder and falling out. I've got a, a shoulder underneath mine. Oh, I missed him. How are you missing him with that? The size of a maggot. Oh. Oh, you see you poaching my head. Damn right, I'm poaching. You want no shame. Yeah. <laughs> it's not happening for me at the moment. Yes. Oh, apart from that one. That's nine. Nine. Nine? Yep, that's that one. Oh, yeah. That's a fish that is, that's a solid one. That's your kicker. Biggest fish wins if we draw, right? Is that, is that how it goes? We're not going to do. This one, we're not. We're not going to fish for another day to try and decide a winner. I've got a little now in this one, but yeah. That's eight. Got him. Oh. Tens. Double figures in fish. So that I've had to wait for that to drop. That that down. that was a bit of jiggling pause. Yeah, just keeping a tight line on the pause. To be honest, my bites have slowed down the last 10 minutes. Fourteen. Right, 20 minutes in, I've had 14 fish, Dan's on nine, so I've had a pretty good start here, but I haven't had a fish for a little while now. We're going to give this a few more minutes and skip to a different bridge. Just wonder if these fish have started to figure out what's going on. Nearly 25 of them have been caught, so haven't picked up the jerk bait since that first fish. The, the micro stuff has been doing the job up until the last few minutes, but I reckon they're still here. Oh, look at this. Look at this. Outrageous. That's a steward's inquiry, that is. If I catch a fish now as well. That'd be minus one point, I reckon. <laughs> right, well, there's no point doing the same thing over and over again. It's not working, so I'll put that jerk bait back on for a few minutes. There's only a couple more minutes before we move. I've seen bait fish getting hit. I don't know if it's pike or perch. I've got a wire trace on. Everything counts, so it doesn't really matter what it is. For someone catching no fish, you've stayed here quite a long time. How many? Just three. Oh, Twelve now. I didn't want you to come over because I know you're attacking straight away. I wanted to um, back you up a little bit at least. Well, you're only two behind me. I, know. I, ba I barely had a tap around there. 
We, we totally knackered him around there. Dan is now within one fish of me. I had a seven fish lead at one point. Stuart's inquiry about Dan not sharing the spot, but we won't talk about that. Oh, apart from that one. Oof, crikey, it's been a long time since I've seen one of these. Forgotten what they look like. Got him. Yep. <laughs> like I did with the first one. I can't hit it off. Okay, so we've had a, a change of location. We've got 40 minutes left of the 90 minute challenge. And at the moment I hold a two fish lead, which in this style of fishing is absolutely nothing. Dan's across the other side of the canal from me over there. I haven't seen him catch one yet, but he wouldn't tell me if he had. Oh, there we go. Right, that is number 17. But he's got friends down there with him as well. Hard structure for perch. This looks ideal. Try and keep this a bit higher in the water column. Oh, big one. Big good fish? Yeah, might be a pike. If that's a perch, it's a good one. Jeez, what are your hooks over there? If that's a perch, that's an absolute belter. It's doing pike lunges, isn't it? Right, while Dan's playing that, I could really do with catching a couple of fish. I've got opportunity here just to... That's a perch, is it? Wow. Oh, mate, what a fish. What a fish. That's a stunner. Okay, so I've just had to go around and uh, do a bit of filming for DB. He's just had an absolute belter, but if you want to see any shots of that fish, you're going to go and have to check out his channel. Only counts as one point, unfortunately, so I'm still in the lead, but I'm a little bit jealous of that one, I must admit. Not quite getting the takes down here I was hoping for. Let's do a little bit of dibbling off here. I don't feel too inclined to go away from what I'm doing. I think in terms of catching numbers, it's the right thing to do. I just need to find where those numbers are. If I don't get any taps, then I might go back and fish a slightly bigger bait up against that up against that bridge. I'm not seeing flashes or you know signs of fish f following this. Oh, apart from that one, there we go. Finally, another one on the board. That's a relief. That puts me back ahead by one. Oh, that was a good take. Definitely missed that one. See if he's got a friend or if he comes back. Oh yeah, good fish, good fish. That's a better fish. Oh, that's it's not the one I was fishing for, but that's another one. That's number 19. There is a much better fish down there. See if I can see if I can get a response from that bigger one. Oh, that's not it's not that one either. That's number 20. Okay, this is working again now. Found some fish. Found a shoal. <laughs> 21. <laughs> yeah, three and three casts here. 22. I found them here. I have found them. It's a shame that bigger one didn't eat. But I'll take the numbers. 22 is giving me another reasonable lead there. Lead of five. It's a small fish behind it, but I don't think he's going to eat it. Oh, there we go. There's a fish. That's better. That's my biggest of the day. Oh, and he's got friends. He's got friends. There's number 23, and I'm very interested in the fish that followed him. Nice fish. But I want to see if his buddies are still down there. Yep, yeah, one of them's behind it. Yep, yeah, got him. That's fish number 24, and this is rocking now. That's a nice fish. Right, let's try it for a second. I'm going to go back down to the bottom end of the pontoon, fish the other rig and see if I can find a slightly bigger fish. 24 is a lot, and I think Dan's going to do well to catch up with that. 
but it'd be nice to catch be nice to catch a big one like a proper sized fish weedless chub 3d bleak is one of my absolute favorites it's on a two gram tungsten chub so it's not going to rock it down it's going to get me down a bit faster keep in contact with that bait that's the key Oh, that was a take. That's the first take I felt. All right, let's get this back down there. That was a long cast. Oh, that's not right. That's not where I wanted it to be, but we'll give it a go. Couple more casts with this. If it's not happening, I'm gonna go back along this pontoon. Bit of a dibble. Nope, I'm putting that away. As nice as the idea of catching the bigger fish is, um, it's gonna take too long. And Dan's gone around the corner. I have no idea how many fish he's catching at the moment. I'm going to change the lure for the next walk up here with one of these little pale pink pin fry things. Because of the way I'm fishing, I don't, I don't need a paddle tail. It's not like I'm casting and retrieving lots. Slightly different colour, slightly different action. Hopefully, similar kind of result because that first walk up here went pretty well. I'm trying to keep the bait in sight just so I can see if there's anything decent following it. I've got some very small fish behind it at the moment. Oh, that one ate it. There we go. Number 25. There we go. The dibble's the way. The dibble's the way. Giving it quite an erratic wobble this time. But I'm fishing it more slowly, so it's not moving very far. With that paddle tail, I felt like I had to move it quite a lot, whereas with this, just having a pintail, I don't have to move it a whole lot to get the action out of it that I need. Hmm. The second walkthrough hasn't gone to plan. I wonder if it's worth me covering some of this weed in front of me. I haven't done casting with this rig for a while. Oh, there we go. That was worth it. That was worth it. Slightly better fish as well. Slightly better as relative. It's not quite as big as Dan's, but... Fish number 26. So maybe we need to cover that water away from the pontoon slightly not something I've been doing so perhaps I've neglected that oh yeah there we go that's definitely worked that's definitely worth a go number 27 there he is maybe we're on to something right I've just checked my watch there are three minutes left three minutes until the 90 is up I'd love to catch three more fish. It'd be great to finish on a, a round 30. There is one minute left. One minute. Come on, just one more fish. Just one. One more fish. Any size. Don't even mind how big it is. Just one extra fish. Guys, we actually came here and won a challenge. I can't believe it. Uh, don't get me wrong. It's probably not the challenge to win and definitely not the way to win it. There's no doubt about the fish of the day. And that was Dan's epic fish that you're going to have to go to his channel to see. So DB Fishing, go and check that out. I finished on 27... 27 to 20. 27 to 20. So we had nearly 50 perch in 90 minutes between us. I've had one nearly every three minutes since we started. I'll be honest, I'm absolutely knackered after that. <laughs> Concentration has been absolutely 100%. But it's been really fun, something I haven't done for ages, something I've, I've kind of forgot how much I enjoy kind of dibbling for perch and trying to do the numbers and stuff like that. So that's been really cool. I'll try and find links for the baits I've used in the description, no doubt about it, finding that little box of eco gear lures made a huge difference there. And has probably been the difference between me winning and losing because I just had smaller hooks and baits. It's yeah. as simple as that, I'd that really mattered. With mine, I've had more bites that are just biting on the back end of the bait that can't get hooked. Than them fish have actually landed. So yes, yeah, so I've got that tiny little 0.8 gram jig head, a size eight hook, and two centimeter bait. So there's it. there's not a lot that I can't hook with that. Guys, hope you've really enjoyed this one. If you want to go and check out uh, DB's big fish, go and check out his channel, DB Fishing. I'll leave a link in the description. Other than that, all I need to say is thank you very much for watching the channel. Really appreciate it. And I be DB or anyone else who's coming fishing with us. We'll catch you again. DB's just missed the river. We'll catch you again very, very soon for some more fishing and stuff. Take care, folks. Bye-bye.